and I said, um, I just got a phone call that my, my mother's not in good condition and I need to go and I need to take some time. And he said, oh, I'm sorry to hear about that, um, but you've only been working here for less than three months. And um, so we don't really offer any sort of leave or, or benefits to someone that hasn't been here for three months. Um, we could let you go um, because we were in a need when we hired you. We can't guarantee that if you're gone for longer than a week or something that we can hold your position. That was blow number one. Blow number two was when I went to price the ticket. Yeah. Yeah. I needed to leave right away. And the cost was about $500 to go from, from uh, Salt Lake City to Houston. And I didn't have the money in my account to do that. And um, like a lot of college kids, I racked up a lot of credit card debt. So my craft, my credit cards were maxed. So I did what probably a lot of us had to do in, in tight situations like that. And I went and got a payday loan. Take those two little lessons that I learned right there, and that all in the same day. Yeah. I had a 3.9 GPA from an esteemed university. I had a great job, a job that I never imagined I would have. But my mother was in a state of unconsciousness, and I did not have the freedom or the ability, financial or time, to, 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 to do what I needed to do at that point in time. A lot of us live that life. A lot of us live in that life where we do not own our life. We, and that's, I did everything perfect. What did I not do right? 